smoke stuff out of it. Wait a minute. Ranch, you're right, smelling inside of that? You don't know. Don't know. <laughs> wow. Stand killer. Oh! <laughs> Mark Lowe. Mark Lowe. <laughs> Mark Lowe. <laughs> Wow! You know for me the smoke man, you is the bubbling star, I the smoking star, right? <laughs> Different type of sauna inside there, boy. Woo! What sauna are you talking about? Will you come out inside there? Eh? Inside that sauna? No, boy! This is Trini Style Smokehouse, boy. What's your name? Trini Style Smokehouse. Where have you been in the shop <laughs> So, wait now. You could do. Where are you in there? What can I make? This is a smoker, right? You just have smoked chicken, smoked duck, smoked pork, wild meat, different smokers. Everything like that. So, we could do some smoked duck and chicken today? You're getting chicken. You're getting duck. You're getting pepper fries. Pepper duck, you ever had smoke pepper duck? I never had smoke duck, we can do that now then. Yeah, come, let me go. Let me go, let me go. <laughs> Alright, so here we here we go do today. We go do a little duck. Watch them duck there. Whoa. Hold one and bring it now, you go deal with it. Now I the tree I'm here, whoa. <laughs> Say hold one. He thinks I'm gonna cry one time. <laughs> bring one, bring one, one time. Baby. You serious? <laughs> bring that one. <laughs> <laughs> bring this one. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, it's all going in. I get it, I get it. I walk for that today. What is it? On the way, baby. We will spare him today, get away. Let me take up some pieces of this lumber and get it in the smoker. I will show you the process and getting this duck ready. Well, let me chop it up. Why you know how to boss one bike? Daddy won't jump, Jan! <laughs> You're getting excited, you carrying away! <laughs> nice! And you want, you want nice chunks of wood when you're smoking, right? Yeah. Smaller the wood parts, I burn out, you know what I mean? Let me do this. Yeah, well, you gotta put in the wood inside the smoker, right? So let me put in the smoke. Just... So wait now, this is a box, like an iron box. Yep. So you build this? Yes. From scratch, it takes me a couple months, it takes me a six months, me and my family. Yeah, me and my two daughters. You know, uh, we gotta go modernize a little bit, you know what I mean? Yeah, because obviously, you gotta like that. I stick pieces of wood. Yeah, well, and what type of wood is this? Holy Bay wood. And you, then you close it in like that, you chuck it. With a piece of wood. With a piece of wood. wood. <laughs> <laughs> you burn it wood, and you chuck it with wood. So I chuck it with a piece of wood. Wow. So guess what? This is inside the smoker. This smoker is huge. I have racks here, I have hooks on top. Just going straight across. The hooks are for what? Different processing meats you smoke differently. Some meats you may rest on racks or hang to smoke. It's about getting the moisture out. Smoke is a very, very, very long and timely process. A duck this takes six hours, a chicken four hours, pork, beef, 10 hours, 16 hours, yeah. 20 hours. And they reward it with excellent flavor. Oh, you would try this one. So guess what? Let me get this duck and start this thing with. Let me start it up. Here we go. So yo, first process, we're gonna season the duck, right? All right, good. Cool. Yeah, a lot of different um, seasoning we just use, right? Nice. So guess what? So I like to put direct. Right. You know what I mean? You I, just like me. That is the base. That is make yeah. it taste good. And then mm -hmm. anything after comes. After we can put whatever, and whatever. Onion so powder. Onion powder go inside here. Yeah. Uh, garlic and parsley. Ginger, garlic, all that fresh stuff, right? Fresh. Good. Nice stuff. Good. All purpose season. You know Smoke I mean? paprika. So this will add to the flavor profile and build on the smokiness. Also. Yes. Alright, so we put in some of the grind seasoning inside it. So it's just a happy paste that you make in here. So anybody can pretty much try this and freestyle at home. Yes. Ah boy, the clove essence. Clove works very well while meat. Yeah, but guess what? Who come up with this? It's a genius. This is, this this is, is good. good. Because normally you'll use the spice, yeah. right? Yes. For a few dashes inside here like that. Of course, you know, clove works very well with smoked meat, whether it be goat, whether it be beef, you name it. And smoky profiles, obviously, clove is amazing inside it. So you might have his own little spice mix that you put in a container that he won't reveal to us. Big Rich is exactly like that. Big Rich 
two ingredients when he was making his curry layers. He didn't reveal to us. Mix it up with your hands. Guess what? You gotta get what's what, your colors now? What's what your colors? What was this? The last two ingredients was like secret ingredients he put inside there. And he just wanna rub it inside now. Oh. And what you do, you rub the inside, the outside. And the back side. And the back side. <laughs> you take out the head as we saw. So what do you think about this duck? Okay. Well, it's smelling up very good already. Whatever the secret ingredient you added inside that black box. Oh, you said that. Oh, so you just have to just... That's some heat inside that. <laughs> Woo! I always tell you, when you're cooking duck, you have to have a little bit of paste in your waist, a little bit of spice. Well, right, I typical sure that, yeah? When they eat in duck, the what thing a little hot, a little spicy, you know what I mean? I hear you. So that's what I do to create my own recipe. I know what typical Trinidadians like, you know what I mean? We like spicy food, we like things with flavor. So we ready to put this in the smoke? So yes, let's put it in the smoker. Let me do it. Duck in the smoker. All the hair in the sizzle, right? All the hair in it. This would go for about all smoke. So I think I done in about five and a half hours. Wow, so it's low and slow. As I mentioned, it is not something that you rush. Does the meat fall off the bone and all that good stuff? And Then we just wait and see, we not rush the man. And see, pick up a piece of wood from there. It's not good. You know we have wood here. You know that. <laughs> big knife again. Here, my big knife. Let me show you how we just do this. Hold on. So you move the neck. Ay, ay, ay. So you, know you go I mean? straight down the center. Yeah. And you just cut it up. So when you serve this, right? Watch now, watch now. Watch how the thing leaking now, boy. Oh, God, boy. Watch how it is. Look at this. People. Try it now, try it now, try it now. Look at this, people. Look at that. Try it now. Look at, Take a bite now. Look at the moisture. And, oh, I go. Try it now. Wow! I don't know that. Mm. They don't call me the smoke, but you is the bubbling star. I the smoking star, right? You know, duck tends to be hard. And you know, we always braising duck and cooking it in some kind of liquid like curry or smoking element of it gives it so much flavor and it breaks on its tender. It's almost like falling off the bone. Yeah, but guess what? And everybody said press. Does it dry? I'm gonna prove you wrong now. Hold on, go around, go around. See it? Watch it. Smoke ring. Smoke ring. This place and just what you call the smoke ring. Hey! You come in! Alright! They might pull out the duck and everybody just have to reach for duck, you know. We're gonna do the breast test. Nice crisp on the exterior, nice brown color, smoke ring, moist, it is shining. That ain't no dry breast. Listen, the breast is even more tender than the other part they just gave me. And that's the breast. I am pressed. I'm so confused because breast always I wish the breast could be drowned in it. Once I build it, guess what? I know how this works. I know how to fine tune it. So this producing that. This is a science, you know. Ladies and gents, trust me. This smoke duck breast is impeccable. Exactly. I'm the child, it's a chicken now. You know that chicken do? Yeah! You can't get duck alone, you know what I mean? You have a little chicken. Watch it down. I'm going to turn it for my boy to see here. And again, the same thing. It, it is incredibly moist. It has a shine on it. Really, you're getting this? Check mm -hmm. this out now. Look at that brilliant shine. That is amazing. Not dry at all. Mm. You know, it is not bombarded or over masked with seasonings. And that's so what that I love that, about it. That's what makes Trinidad Smokehouse house different. That is the difference with it. But there's a few people that are actually doing smoke meat in Trinidad and Tobago. And yes, you can see it's obvious. They have his own formula. Yeah. And he's using it and he's very secretive to some degree. And that is why. That is his trademark. Yes, you see what I can do with duck. You see what I can do with chicken. I doing that with wild meat too. Lap, tattoo, go to the When it's on the season, check me. Check, you serious? Man. Check, man, you got a ball. Alright, so duck. I taste the duck, I taste the chicken. You gonna make a little pepper duck, mm -hmm. a little pepper fries. You don't need to convince my partner. Let me do it. We use Trinidadians, so you get Trini style. Let me roll. Let me roll. Andy, what do you have inside here, boy? This is pepper here. But here, what's going on? When it's too hot, you gotta put on your mask. Wait, can I take gas mask for one? Yes. I feel unprepared. <laughs> Well, no one can do anything, you know what I mean? What? <laughs> That's your peppers inside here. Onion and sweet peppers. Water. Hey, man, you're gonna kill me. Black pepper, chili flakes, parsley, and cayenne. 
Yeah, 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 beast mode. And all that going inside there. See? Soy sauce, oyster sauce. Wow. So now, it's that time. Try peace now, your turn. Ah, you're good to go. You try that. Taste in your waist. Let me be up more Andy. Pepper fries. Pepper fries. So let them know when only want pepper fries, three times smoke out. Guess what? You ever hear about smoke pepper duck? Yeah, let hear me right. Smoke pepper duck. I can make it on surely. What's up? So guess what? So fry the duck a little. So we put a little of this and a little of that. You see a hot duck? Without a little rose, jira. You gotta put a little rose jira in it, right? Smelling that, you're always smelling that. Smoke, pepper dog. Witness, cheap brand jira smelling inside of that? You don't know. You don't Ooh. know. <coughs> wow. He's trying to kill us. <laughs> oh, oh. <coughs> Man, boy. No man, you guys are... Tell us what you think, Ray. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Trust me. I may not be able to talk fluently right now, but that jira in that duck made all the difference. The coffin, smoke, pepper duck. With a hint of jira. Doing these episodes are we outside. We get to taste great food throughout Trinidad and Tobago. Great entrepreneurs, establishments who are doing great stuff. And if anybody has to come down and check you, where are you? My name is my business is Trini Size Smoke House, 101 Puna Junction, William Sill, 705-1692. You can contact us on WhatsApp or Facebook, Instagram, Trini Size Smoke House, YouTube, Trini Size Smoke House. That's nice what we're talking about. So I mean, you know, let us know if you love this episode, comment below. That's what it is. We outside. Boom. Later, guys. This is my duck? <laughs> Head on! <laughs> is this Donald or is this Daffy? What was your name? I don't know. Come on, let me deal with this duck now, man. So, yo.